Hello and welcome to a new video. Today I want to make a short experiment and find out if we can make radiation visible on a smartphone camera. I am completely aware that this is nothing new. BioNerd did this like 15 years ago. I am still curious if we can make this work with as low effort as humanly possible. The phone I am using is a Huawei P10 from 2017. Two small pieces of uraninite will be used as a radioactive source. Here I am using a blade to remove the protective glass in front of the lens. The goal is to get the electrons from beta radiation to reach the CCD. Since the probability of interaction with the sensor is higher with particle radiation. On the other hand, I don't feel like removing the lens itself. That would destroy the camera functionality. I am also not going to cover the lens except by putting the source in front. I want to see if we can get an effect with visible light present. As you can see, we have retained the full functionality of the camera. And here you see the small lenses. They would be a nightmare to remove. The lens protection is not very thick, but we also want to get the source as close to the sensor as we can so that the inverse square law can work to our advantage. Let's put down some lead bricks to at least act like we care about radiation protection. And here are the two sources. Probably some of the hottest sources considering the small size. Even hotter and larger pieces would not help very much. As you can see, quite spicy for something smaller than my already small thumb. Okay, here we go with the first try. Maybe we can already see something while filming up close. That already worked, I guess. Let's play around a little more.
Okay, to summarize. If you want to try this, you need a relatively potent source, get as close to the sensor as possible, shield as little particle radiation as possible, and minimize the amount of visible light, since the artifacts are easier to see when it's dark.